What is dark matter and dark energy? Many would believe that the majority of the known universe is made up of normal matter, which is everything around us that's a solid, liquid, or a gas, or the other normal states of matter such as plasma. However, the majority of the universe is actually made up of 68% dark energy and 27% dark matter, leaving about 5% for normal matter. So since the universe is made up of so much dark energy and dark matter, what exactly is it? That's the question. Scientists aren't really sure what it is, but we do know it's there because we've seen the effects it has on the universe. To begin to understand, let's start with dark matter. No, it's not matter that happens to be dark, non-luminescent, or matter going through a goth phase. It's something we can't see, and it's undetectable with our technology so far, but we do know it's there. The first person to discover it was an astrophysicist named Fritz Zwicky. He noticed that some galaxies and clusters, all of them orbiting each other, were moving at incredibly fast velocities, most likely would get a speeding ticket. These fast velocities are created by very strong gravitational forces, which means that the galaxies he observed should have a very large mass. To better understand this, imagine that you were on a merry-go-round at a playground, and it's spinning very, very fast. As it speeds up, you'd have to hold on tighter. This is just like the fast velocity galaxies, where gravity has to be stronger to hold it together. So when Zwicky added up the masses and compared it to his estimation, the numbers were way off. The mass he summed up was way less than it should be. This became the crisis of missing mass. This missing mass we now assume is dark matter because it allows for the fast moving galaxies to stay together. Now let's talk about dark energy. In the 1920s, Edwin Hubble discovered that the farthest galaxies were red shifting, which is a shift in the frequency of light, which showed us that the universe was expanding at an increasing rate. According to the laws of gravitational attraction, after the Big Bang, the universe should have collapsed back on itself, or at least be slowing down. But instead, it's actually accelerating and expanding. Think of Isaac Newton throwing an apple into the air. As it goes up, it slows down, and it comes right back down due to gravity. Now imagine if when you threw the apple up into the air, it didn't come back down, and was going up faster and faster. What? <laughs> to attempt to understand this, Scientists decided that there must be a dark energy that is constant and keeping the universe expanding at the increasing rate. This mystery of dark energy has left many scientists intrigued on what exactly it is. We know that gravity is the force that pulls things back to a center with enough mass. So dark energy is like the opposite of gravity that pulls everything away, making the universe bigger and bigger. So far, this is what most scientists know, but yet even the scientists are puzzled on this odd behavior of the universe. Therefore, there's so much more we can explore and discover.